Hello everyone, my name is Eddie Lee. I'm one of the founders of Funktronic Labs. We're a game studio based in Los Angeles. And today, excited to talk to you about some of the new stuff that we have going on in uh, the Light Brigade. Uh, since we launched about two weeks ago, uh, we listened to a lot of the feedback from the community, Discord, Reddit, you know, Twitter, and we collected it all. We've, we've, we've been listening with you know, open mind, and we wanted to address a lot of the common concerns that people have been uh, voicing and encountering. All this will apply as well to the PlayStation VR 2, uh, the Quest 2, and the Steam version as well. So this is just our testing that we use to um, kind of test a lot of things. One of the biggest uh, feedback that we received from the community is regarding the aiming. You know, your movement encumbrance only engages when you're aiming. So you can see now that if I'm holding my gun away, if I point up, it slows down. So it allows me to kind of go around here. Boom, boom, shoot. Boom, 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 shoot. Well, since we're in here, you know, we have a lot of other options as well. You know, we kind of organized a lot of these extra options. We added a ton. We also made it, you know, um, made it easier for people to navigate. You know, a lot of people complain about like uh, turn speed. So we made turn speed a lot faster. People go fast, ultra faster. They could deal with their own custom one if they're crazy enough, you know. Um, when you went to like one of the ammo changing stations, you had to like quickly, you know, you had to quickly grab things and kind of put it in. We made it easier such that like if if you're able to just grab one, instead of throwing it in, you can just press trigger. And it kind of just, oops, it kind of just teleports directly in. So you, you don't have to worry about like finding it in battle or during your ammo um, re-up station. When you end run the game, it actually uh, preserves your purified soul. So before, when you would end run, um, you would lose all your progress and people were really unhappy about that. So we, we changed it so that it's basically like a suicide. We also added another even more difficulty, New Game Plus Plus Plus, for those who found New Game Plus or New Game Plus Plus to be too easy. Yeah, I guess besides that, we have <laughs> a lot more um, things as well. I, I could just list off basically all the uh, change log that we have engaged. So we added additional New Game Plus difficulty layer. Added ammo, auto store, and press, added eye tracking for you uh, from people who want to boss to teleport to the boss to press bug report for people to fix wrong mesh on boss 2. Improved the astronaut hand generation time mission detection, improved audio training, improved time graphs, improved the large hand generation, improved the test routes, improved the test routes, improved the test routes, Okay, so, you know, that's a lot of changes, you know, a lot of updates, you know, we've planned to stay committed to improving the game and performance. We want to um, make sure that this game becomes one of the most premier, you know, roguelike VR experiences, and we're committed to making this game, you know, better and better so we view this uh, we view the light brigade not just as you know a 1.0 launch but we view it, view it as like a living title where we want to constantly be improving and adding new things all the time we just want to serve the community and make sure that this game is awesome so thank you for your time um, appreciate it you know after this update you know we plan to do a um, content update so even though this one has no new stuff it's just a bunch of like fixes and quality improvements you know our next one we plan to have a pretty sick uh, content drop so expect that coming down the pipeline and yeah see you on the battlefield bye join the light brigade or else